Aviation has a key role to play in building a sustainable future. It generates significant social and economic development. And so the whole sector has committed now to a net zero carbon emission by 2050. It's going to require unprecedented collaboration to make that happen and partnership, uh, but we're committed together. Airbus is contributing to the decarbonisation of the aviation sector uh, with actionable roadmaps. We're looking at the renewal of um, aircraft technology with latest generation technology. Only 12% of the fleet flying today is flying on latest technology. We're looking at developing and accelerating the development of energy pathways with our partners. That means sustainable aviation fuel. Today the aircraft flying are certified to fly with a 50% mix of kerosene and sustainable aviation fuel. And we're looking to accelerate the development of hydrogen pathways. We have the ambition to fly the first commercial aircraft in service uh, using hydrogen combustion in 2035. So ITF has provided a platform to enable the real conversations about the challenges that we face as a transportation sector in the decarbonisation journey. Uh, we've had some very interesting discussions, uh, developing economies, developed economies and the different levels of collaboration and partnership that are going to be essential to really decarbonise the transportation sector going forward.